The Evil Customer, Part 2. Four years later. Wear sandals everywhere or I kill you. Which way? That way. Get off my beach. What do you want? I want you to stop. Threaten me will get you nowhere. I am not just any ordinary criminal as people fear me I will get bigger and stronger. There he is. Forget it, I ain't surfing after him. Excellent work Skoswald. People all over the place fear what's coming. We will make everyone suffer. Everyone will bow down to us. Now is the time we fight back. These footprints mean only one thing. It means he isn't alone. I want a wife. We'll arrange that. First we'll need to put a whole bunch of Papa's customers in danger. Papa will try and rescue them. We'll attack then. He's gone to Starlight City. We'll make a quick pit stop at Professor Fitz's lab. He has something I need. Great is to reach the city before Scottsfield. Frostfield is closer to Starlight City from my office. Don't worry. Professor Fitz knows us. Welcome, welcome. How may I assist you? Where's Fitz? I need to warn him about something. Place the potions on the conveyor belts quickly. We can't let Scott's wall get to them. There it is. Right. Grab these three and then we are done. He's drinking one of our potions. Now then, I want Millie. Either she marries me or I disintegrate everyone. Leave my customers alone. Like my new one? Now we are going to go to Onion Town to cause massive massacre. Papa Louie either surrenders or people die. Dark Xander, you're still alive. That's right. Now back away before we disintegrate you. You can't run forever. We will get you. They're planning to cause a big train massacre in Onion Town. And that potion Scott's wall drank will make him bigger and stronger. Quick. We haven't got a moment to lose. We need to stop them. We cannot allow anyone to hurt innocent train passengers. We better equip ourselves. All aboard. Quick. The train is leaving. I have a stitch. We can't keep up. We'll have to fly up there. Seriously, 